right guys, we're gonna go to Dr. Fish. As the fish eat old horny, skin is smooth. Let's go. Dr. Fish, Dr. just stop to wash your feet and come back to <laughs> yes, very hungry. <laughs> Dude, the tickles, dude. Dude, the tickles. They're like going in between my toes. That's where the goods are. Alright, just got out of the, the beautiful spa here. How'd you guys like that? That was. Wow. That was an experience. <laughs> oh. Alright, so our next destination. Meiji Jingu. Oh my goodness. We just made it to Meiji Jingu, and this is our first arch we have here. This place is basically like a giant park. This is a shrine for Emperor Meiji and his coast consort, Empress Shoken. It's so different from the city because look. Just in the middle of the forest. You can hear the cicadas. <laughs> you hear it all the time in animes and the movies. No. <laughs> Now we're just kind of like exploring, walking around the big, huge park. I have no idea what this is. Looks like someone's house. A dentist? This is a pretty bougie dentist. Really nice because it's not super hot. It's pretty overcast right now. We started the day very early. We started at about 4.30 and it feels like we've done so much but a lot of these stores aren't even open yet. Alrighty, so we're just walking around Harajuku and now we're going to a cat cafe. I know. Oh gosh, <laughs> we're doing this. The, the clothes will be very humorous. You're spinning! <laughs> he graced my ear. <laughs> Just water? <laughs> oh, so you just choose which one you want? 
<gasps> Strawberry milk. So it's pretty much all you can drink here. You press a button for which one you want, and then you get a lid. Yeah, cups and drinks are automatic. Oh my gosh, he's petting it pretty violently. Let's go. That was fun. It was about seven bucks for 20 minutes of time with the cats and all you can drink uh, drinks. Cat Cafe if you're in Japan. I would recommend it if you like cats. I mean, I'm not like crazy, but I don't mind them. So yeah, we stayed in there for about 20 minutes. So not bad, I'd say. Today has been mostly just walking around Harajuku and just looking at all the different stores they have around here. And it's been really nice so far and we went to like Uniqlo, Uniqlo Muji and we're, now we're headed to Tower Records to look at music. Do something! Don't follow him on his Instagram. So he has the worst stories in, in the history of Instagram. Walking around the Tower Records building, it's like seven different floors and each floor has something different and this is the cafe. What I noticed about here in Shinjuku is that a lot of these stores have like multiple levels and each level is dedicated to like a certain category of items that they sell at that um, type of store. So currently we're on the second floor of Tower Records which is their cafe. Today is still only our first day here in Japan and I think I spent well over $100 um, not even including the, the Skyliner ride, uh, train ride we had to, to get to um, our Airbnb. We gotta really uh, lay off the spending for a while. If the next couple of days we're just eating konbini food, I don't mind. Uh, <laughs> just to save a bunch of money because I spent a lot already. <laughs> But this is, this is so cool. Alright guys, this is the moment we've been waiting for for two years. We're gonna eat at Ichiran Ramen. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait. Can you wait? I can't wait.
how we order the extras. Oh my gosh. Goodbye, friend. I've been waiting for this for years. Taste the broth first. That's quirky. Let's dig in. Everything I hoped for in a bowl of ramen I've been waiting for for two years. This does not disappoint. <laughs> oh my. All oh, right, I added the egg inside there. Let's see what the goods look like. Now that's wonderful. So I just let them know that I wanted more noodles. Let's go! I am ready. sad end but a bittersweet end. I also ordered the matcha tofu and so here it goes. Me and her go way back. <laughs> That is beautiful. It look how it glistens. That's wonderful. I forgot to put the matcha sauce. That's. I gotta say, that's pretty attractive right there. That's... Oh no. I just finished the matcha tofu. I gotta say, that was one of the best things I've had so far. And it's only day one here in Japan. Makes me decide to see what happens next. We're gonna head back to the Airbnb and have a Kanak attack. And rest our fragile bones because we've been walking since 4.30 this morning. And I'm ready. I'm gonna crash already. So, <laughs> see you guys there. We stopped by the Airbnb. We rested for a little bit through all of our devices on the charger. So we're now all juiced up. And I'm here with Stefan. Just the two of us. Just two of us, Hannah and Tim, decided to stay back. Me and Stefan are on our way to the onsen right now. About to get naked. <laughs> Do it. My feet hurt, so I'm really looking forward to sitting in the onsen right now. I think we're starting to get the hang of the, the trains, right? Yeah. Better yeah. than when we first got here. We're like, See, the only reason I wasn't heck? getting the hang of it earlier is because you were navigating. I'm like, okay, I have no idea oh, where we're going right now. Oh, because I'm navigating. Oh, this is this entire thing is the Hibiya line. Oh, we're starting to get it now. It's, it's a little bit easier. Okay. You can first. That's the... Alright, so me and Stefan just came from the onsen and I gotta say it was the most one of the most interesting things I've ever done. I definitely recommend it though because my feet hurt but now it doesn't hurt as much but it feels amazing. It's something you gotta get used to. But now we're here at McDonald's. Kimi. Tsukimi burger here. 
It basically has meat, egg, cheese, and sauce and bacon. Also got this zucchini pie. Not too sure what the filling is. Here it is. Japan exclusive. Let's try it. It looks like red bean and mochi. I'm not the hugest fan of red beans, but mixed together with the mochi and the crunchy um, shell, it's an A plus for me. So this will be the end of this vlog. This is our first first official day in Japan, and I'm super excited to see what happens next because it feels like it's been like a week at least, and really it's only been. <laughs> Today was the first full day here in Japan, so really excited for what happens next. Um, stay tuned in to the next episode, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Now we're on our way to Tokyo Sky Tree. Get both.